Hello brethren, hello guys, how you guys doing today? Thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing. The Lord gave me three prophetic dreams to start a church, to become a pastor and start a church. The first dream the Lord gave me, I was walking with a group of people, maybe like five or more, we walk into this, um, it looks like a auditorium. No, I don't think it was, it was not an auditorium. It was a conference room. We walk into this conference room. It could have been a church, you know, I don't remember. And then I said, there's no pastor here. How come, who was the pastor? And everybody said, you're the pastor. That's the first dream the Lord gave me. The second dream the Lord gave me to become a pastor and start a church. I was at a church. This is in, in the prophetic dream. This pastor was preaching. The audience, I mean the parishioners, they just got up from their seat. They was angry with what the pastor did. They, just, they felt like the pastor was not pushing the truth. But for some reason, they grabbed the pastor and they pulled him from the pulpit and they point their fingers at me and they say, you preach the gospel. You become the pastor. That's the second dream the Lord gave me about becoming a pastor. The third dream the Lord gave me to become a pastor, it was like um, in the prophetic dream, it looks like it was during Christmas time. Everybody was was in the church just having a good time, you know, people on the stage dancing, just enjoying the holidays, celebrating our Lord's birth. And then I just walk into the church, and the church was multiracial. It's a very diverse church. And, you know, in the spiritual realm, you already know things. You know, you don't guess, you just know things. So I just walked in, I knew that I was the pastor, and everybody was seem like the party was waiting upon me. And this guy, you know, he said, uh, he looks, you know, Caucasian male, and I said to him, what's your name? And he told me his name, and I just smiled, and then he smiled because he had this Italian name. I said, that's a beautiful name. And everybody, you know, like I said, I believe the Lord is going to give me a church. He's going to make me pastor for church that's diverse and that's a good thing you know I believe and you know it's good for us to worship together regardless of our background you know Jesus is the center doesn't matter what your your race your your nationality your ethnicity we all are one in Christ so and then I, I went there and you know walked into the church and so he gave me it was at least three or four dreams. There was another dream that he gave me. And it was four dreams he gave me. The four dreams. It, he gave me more than four dreams. He gave me at least five. Um, but I, I mentioned three because those three dreams was more vivid. You know, the first one was, you know, just everybody was telling me that you should be the pastor. The second dream was the same thing. And the third dream was I walk into a church as a pastor. So, but he gave me two other dreams. Um, one dream when I where I walked in, and um, when I walked into the church, and I was everybody was just sitting down, everybody was just looking at me. I was standing right in front of them. I was talking to them. And I was trying to give them my telephone number. Um, you know, if they have any problem, they could give me a call as their pastor. So that was the four dreams. And another dream he gave me was uh, where I was preaching um, to the people. And I said, you know what? Come home to your father. You know, the Lord Jesus is your father. So he gave me multiple dream about um, starting a church. And I thank you guys for being part of this ministry, for sharing my videos, for watching my videos. And, you know, if you guys are blessed, and, you know, if you guys ever need my prayer, just let me know.
just let me know whatever you, you're struggling with, I'll pray for you guys. And, you know, keep fighting a good fight. Keep holding on to the Lord, holding on to what's true, holding on to what's righteous. Because our time on this earth is very limited. The Lord's return is imminent. So we, we don't want to get caught up in things of this world. May the Lord bless you guys. Um, thank you for watching. If you guys would like to support my ministry, I'll put a link. Um, I'll put this a link underneath the video. You guys can click on that link. And again, thank you, thank you again.